So, do you want the hometown team to cut athletics, cut the busing, raise the taxes to deal with this budget? Finance committee meeting on Monday. I'm hosting three Zooms this week. Um, Saturday, 8 a.m., Saturday, 8 p.m., and Sunday, 8 p.m. Let's go over the budget. Let's get the questions you need answered so you can make an informed decision. Do you know all the mandates that are required? How many teachers overtown pay are we making? Why do we have a grass cutter contract? And then buy new mowers. Let's find out. Let me get me out of here for a second. What I'd like to do is take a look at who's in charge? Who's responsible? Do these guys tell them what to do? Or does this guy tell them what to do? Or this guy tell them what to do? Or are all of these people subordinate to that board so we can make an educated decision? Going to host three Zooms. I hope you can make it. Sunday, 8 p.m. Saturday, 8 p.m. And tomorrow morning, early. Thank you. We're going to go over a couple things. I think we ought to go over some of the waste. When the district spent money, right? Challenging the right to know law. What a waste. Look at that. Right? Down here. It failed to meet the substantial burden. What are we doing? Why are we spending money on this stuff, right? Ackerman tells us that we have a right to investigate as directors, okay? Palm says it's the duty of the school board member, right? To be informed. It's our job. Luigi, it would also be advisable to review the invoices in deciding the amount to budget for future years. We need to look at the data. If we don't look at the data, how are you going to make a good decision? I need you guys to help me get the questions we need because you have more information than I do. You know what's going on with your kids in these schools. You know what's going on with your neighbors and your friends. That's why we represent you. We grab stakeholder input. It's a requirement. LASD policy. Right? Show me the money. There's a disciplinary board. It should be reviewed how it works, right? The principles include the lawyer's obligation zealously to protect and pursue a client's legitimate interest. Was it legitimate to go after the constitutionality of the right to know law, blocking information from directors? Rules of conduct, right? Here it says the term shall and shall not, right? as compared to may or should. Let's talk about section 426, right? You got the Pennsylvania School Code, section 218 says we got, we're supposed to do a uh, annual financial report by the district, right? It's due at the end of October. Ours is due in March. It talks about the penalties, the responsibilities, right? And there's a penalty under 2552, $300 a day. Are we spending money on this? We should know. Good question to ask. Who does the budget, right? It says the board of school directors shall prepare a proposed budget, not the administration. It's our job. Help us do our job. Force your elected officials to do their job and follow the law, right? Should we follow the law? I think so, right? With proper managerial controls, we stand a good chance to be able to cut the taxes, right? Without cutting mandated educational responsibilities or the sports or athletic teams or the local busing, right? We can go through all these. We look forward to seeing you on the Zoom. Have yourself a great day. Oh, by the way, the total amount 
of the budget shall not exceed the amount of the funds. So when you hear Larry Stern talk in a meeting about fictitious numbers, I think it's time to fix this problem. I think it's time to fix the immorality that we find in this board. When the president of a board responsible to prepare the budget, this board's responsibility is to prepare that budget. It says that fictitious, right? Where you got a guy like Steve Holland that, that feasibility said didn't even have a copy, right? How can they act with fidelity if they don't have information? And then when I seek information, they block it. We're here for you. Looking forward to hearing your questions so we can ask the board, get them answered prior, prior to making a decision. We should be informed. Have yourself a great day. Thanks.